Welcome everybody to episode 12 of Stardew Valley with Kavita. We are checking stuff out. I think we should find Robin out here building us a, um, what do you call it? Building us, I know, brain is so slow. A silo. There you go. I know. I feel like one of those sloths in um there, see it's in there. In in what's that game? Not that game. In Zoo, is it Zoo? Zootopia, there you go. Oh no, I've locked my chickens in. They will not be happy with me. I feel that they're destroying the grass though. You see the grass is just flying everywhere. I should probably gather the eggs as well. Alright, so if you put your chickens in a nice grassy area, you tend to not have to feed them. That's kind of very cool. And I don't remember it being a thing in um, in the other games. Uh, sorry, in the, in the earlier games that I've played. So I don't know if I'm waffling over nothing and it's just something I've missed. Or if it's actually something they've added in. Either way, I really like it. Okay, so I think probably our first chore for the day should be to go see Pierre. Um, I might just throw these eggs in here as well. Silver star egg is good. Maybe it means we're getting closer to having a big egg. Or oh, some grapes. I'll grab those in a minute. First things first though. See, I don't play multiplayer so I don't get that <laughs> real anxiety that someone else is going to grab it before I do. nice. You just chill a little bit. Chillax. Okay, we are gonna head over this way and check and see if this is a more... Yeah, let's accept Clint's quest. They're pretty good. Uh, we might have to move ourselves on it though. Welcome to Pierre's. All right, we needed tomatoes. We needed blueberries. We needed chili peppers. What was the other thing that we needed for our um Okay. Tomatoes, chili peppers, blueberries, and we've got the melons growing. The other thing we wanted to check out was Okay, so I needed corn, pumpkin, and melons in the gold star variety. So let's um see what else Pierre has. He sells wheat. Wheat looks good. Radish, poppy seeds, spangled hops was what they mean. Ah, oh, there's corn. Oh, that was expensive. Hopefully it'll pay off. This one's said to, to crop again and again, so hopefully we'll get a ton of stuff out of it. Sounds like I'm broke again. All right, fine, I'll live with it. I could sell some of this basic retaining soil. All right, and I really want to get into my trees, but it looks like I might be a little bit uh, spendy on other things for that. That's fine, we're going to have a good go at um, getting our 15, our 15 crops uh, for some of these at least. But the problem is, is I'm not going to be able to remember which ones I've sold 15 of. Hmm. Let's get as much of these into the ground as we can. Okay, this is my speed grow field, isn't it? So what we might do, I'll just let me go grab the speed grow, is we might put our slower growing crops into here. I'll just put some of this up onto the top so I can easily see it. Something tells me I'm going to need my snacks handy and I'm going to need my hoe handy. Ho, ho, ho. I know, I'll stop now. 
I'll pop those in there and pop those up there. It's daytime, I shouldn't need my sword, right? Maybe. <laughs> All right, let's grab our speed grow. There's, there's a space here. Let's grab our... Do I, I didn't get any more melon seeds, okay. All right, 14 days. 11 days. But this one goes summer to full, so I get to keep them. Uh, 11 days, 13 days, 11 days, 8 days, 5 days. All right, looks like it's blueberries then. We're going to have ourselves a little crop of these things. Not what I intended. I know, I've got to watch where I'm hoeing. I'm trying to be tidy with my hoeing. Up. It's like in a minute, I'm just going to give up and do the whole field. This is just one way of getting it out of my backpack. Alright, so if we're going to plant tomatoes and we need our gold star tomatoes, let's grab some fertilizer. And we'll just try and get... Actually, I think I should have planted some of those blueberries. No, no. It's, what was it for gold star crops? Uh, I don't know. Yep. Okay, so we needed uh, gold star melons and gold star corn. Okay, we did. There's the corn. All right, we did. And I don't think I put the melons into, oh, I'm gonna have to buy some more. Oh no, it doesn't look like you're using up much energy until you start watering, then you're in trouble. Every time, man. Every time. They've all got their bait in them. Let's just get that out of our back, out of our hands. Right, we're good. CD can go. The mussels we're going to ship. That's fine. Let's put this back up the top. I know. What? Is that my afternoon happening already? Oh no. That's done. Let's grab ourselves a hoe. I'm such a happy bunny. Oh no, let's... Because it's annoying me. Okay. So we planted all the corn. We haven't planted... So everything else should be fine. Um, the really thing I hate about hops is they block where you go. So I need to do something special with them. We might just... Land all of these in here and what are all of these so I really do need to go mining because we're going to need a ton of stuff to make um, beer barrels and and all those things that you make good crops out of uh, jams and so on all right hops because they're a pain in the neck Three, 
six. This way, what are you doing? No, no, wow. All right, who gave you control of the hoe girl? I know, the same crazy person that said you knew how to be a farmer. My bad. And, and the same crazy person that said you might know how to count. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, okay, shh. There we go. Okay, what have we got? I think I may have forgotten to water a field. Yeah, there we go. I should think about um, doing sprinklers soon as well. So that's all of that done. Let's just put everything back where it's meant to be. There we go. And how close are we to having enough clay for another silo? Not close enough? No. Alright, so what we might do is we might spend the evening uh, down the mines. I need to go deal with whatever that tap... Ah, oh, tappers. We need to make some more of those too. Um, what, wood and copper. And I think I might have enough copper for at least one more. Yeah, I know. Cry, baby, cry. Oh, and I wanted to make a charcoal kiln eventually. Probably not right now. Stop waving that around. All right, so we're going to put our, our next tapper right there. Grab that. I'm pretty sure I can use it for something. And I think it might be time to go looking for things. I've got to ship one, don't I? Let's just make sure I don't need another one for the um, the bundles. Pretty sure I didn't need one in here, so it must be one of the others. Winter, summer, exotic, fall. No, it wasn't for that. It wasn't for that. It was one of these. Weird. And it might have been maple syrup, which means I'm going to need another maple syrup tapper. Nope, there we go. We need the oak resin for a bundle. Right. Along with some wine, I better keep some grapes. Okay. Let's just put the oak resin in here for the minute, because we're going to need some of these other things for the bundle as well. So I've got two of what I need, there is one more. Although if I happen to find it, I'm going to be sad that I'm not carrying the rest on me. So why don't... Oh no, because we need to mine for um, for the dude. Uh, yeah, you know who I mean. So what we might do is we might remember, I think it's... Is it Willamac? No, Jose. It was Jose's suggestion that we put a... Uh, a box down in the mine. I think that's a pretty good idea so I might just grab that because then we can dump all our stuff in, go down into the mines, come back and dump all our stuff and I still have room. So let's put that there. Put that up there. Grab these and put them up there. There we go. So that's good as long as I don't forget. Haha! <laughs> what are the chances of that? I know, shush. Alright, so I know it's light now, but we might see how many of these torches we can get out of our backpack. Uh, and we might just... Put them in so that we...
can have this just like this little path of light leading home I might put one up here on the corner as well I think that rock pile gets cleared so we might just leave it I mean I'm sure Linus won't object too much to having the area around him a little bit brighter then again he might complain about there being too much light hopefully not I mean, he does have a campfire just outside his door, so he should be pretty right. We're probably not disturbing him. Maybe. I know. It's like, where can I put the... If it gets in the way of my fishing, I'll dig it up. It'll be fine. All right, let's grab this. We might put it in inside the mine though. Excellent. All right, so we can, so we probably won't need, we might need our scythe. We won't need our hoe or our ax or our watering can. I'm not sure if I'm gonna go fishing or not. There we go, how many? How many coppers? We need a 20 radio. Let's see how we go on level 20 or below. That's right. We went fishing here the other time. Whoa! All right, 20 coppers, right? Normally it's it's a lot harder than this. It all depends on how many flies I'm about to get stung by. Awesome. Well, that's a good start. It gives me hope that I might get this mission done. I'm not liking the look of these grublets over in the corner. And I should probably, before I go too much further, eat my snacks. I know, we are going to have to get a kitchen. Was it 10,000 for the house expansion? Yeah, we might start saving for that next. I love these field snakes, they're a lifesaver. Okay, let's take our sword and start some trouble. I know, I'm about to get at least just one fly. That's not so bad. Where is it? And it's mad because I tried to murder it as a baby. Haha. <laughs> Phew, that wasn't as bad as I thought. I think that sword is... I don't think I've ever actually used one at this early in the level. You know what, we didn't need our scythe because we have our sword, it does the same job. Uh, yeah, I know. Just call me dopey. So, um, excellent. We're going to go get some bug bait first though. I know, as soon as we get that 20, we are going to have to hit topside, maybe. What is it, 1050? Okay, there's no point hitting topside straight away. Because the the very wonderful dude who gave us the mission won't be there. So I'm thinking... See, that works just as well. I'm thinking we might just keep mining then. And maybe see how far down we can go. Can we get to level 25? No, it's 11.35 p.m. We won't get to level 25. Fine. Let's just go on a bit of a hacking. Oh my gosh, you can side the boxes. And I need to go home. I knew that. All right. I know, it had to be done. It was green and annoying me. <laughs> uh, let's get out of here. Leave the mine and bolt for home. Oh, wait. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, I like this whole new light thing. I can see I've left a few a little bit far apart though. We're going to have to make some more of these torches. Yeah, these needed to be closer together. That's okay, I'm learning the whole torch thing. See, these are nice. I'm not afraid of the dark. You are. Okay. Alright, we're going to play another day, but if you're liking this episode so far, please hit like, and if you want to see more, please hit subscribe. But uh, let's see what the night brings, shall we? Oh, that sounded big and crashy. Haha, <laughs> level 3 mining, plus 1 pickaxe proficiency and a new cooking recipe, the miner's treat. I really need that kitchen. For 12 for the eggs, not too bad. It's a good start. We're going to be a little while before our crops help us recoup what we've, uh, what we've spent like madmen. There was an earthquake during the night. And it's Wednesday. Let's see if there's any repeats worth having. This week's dish, oh, radish salad. I think I already know that. That's okay. At least if I'd missed it, I would, I would have it again. Oh, hi Corvida. I have some good news for you. A few days ago, I made a breakthrough in my research on the local environment. I'll spare you the technical details and get to the point. You know that empty cave over there a little ways to the west? Well, I have a way to turn it into something useful. Really? For both of us. Okay. I'd like to set up the cave to attract some local species. That way I can observe them in a more controlled environment and you can harvest whatever products they produce. I can either set up the cave to attract mushrooms or fruit bats. The bats will sometimes leave fruit for you to collect. Uh, I would prefer mushrooms because, you know, I might accidentally kill your fruit bats. Alright, I'll go set it up for you right now. It shouldn't take any time at all. Thanks for letting me do this. You're welcome, Demetrius. Awesome. Kavita, this is embarrassing. I, I lost my lucky purple shorts, and I'm telling you because I, I think I can trust you. If you find them, bring them back to me discreetly. I'll pay well. Thanks, Mayor Lewis. Okay. His purple shorts. Like, undershorts if I remember correctly. <laughs> His lucky shorts. So, oh man, we're not taking that 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 uh, any further. Rightio, we need to find the mayor's lucky shorts. It's, um... You know, you'd think if a grown man could keep track of his shorts, right? Yeah. Okay. I'm not quite sure what he's doing, but anyway, let's um I have to say I don't think much of this water retaining soil. Next time I'm just gonna sell it. I know I didn't put any here, I think I put it up in the top patches. And we'll talk to the scarecrows, because I've I've heard um the crows get particularly rambunctious in summer. Let me just get rid of some of this. Oh, actually, no. I need to hang on to the... We can take this over to Thingamy What's It, maybe. All right, let's get rid of these just for the minute. And I guess we'll throw some of that in. I was not killing slimes all night. That was you. I need to go talk to Clint. Okay, so we need to talk to Clint too before it gets too much later. There we go. All right. You know what? What gets me is how much these CDs happen to like um, bait. Which reminds me that's got to go in there. Let's go sell ourselves a, uh, a lobster. I know. I'm going to clean up this corner of my farm eventually. Oh, that's right. We are not smelting down the ore. And I forgot to refill my watering can. Goodness me. All right, let's get everything. And 
I needed to buy more melons because I very foolishly put the melons in the speed grow and I didn't put them in the um, in the fertilizer so I don't know if that's gonna actually cause me any benefit all right we need to go see Clint if we're gonna go see Clint we might as well take these with us uh, we don't yeah we're not gonna make copper bars yet because then I would be sad because I wouldn't have the copper bars for Clint let's go check out and see what Demetrius did to our cave pretty sure it's all above board so that's okay Shall I water them? I don't know. Does it make any difference if you water them? It doesn't look like it. And am I wrecking? Am I wrecking Demetrius's experiment by watering the? Uh, yeah, uh, that's probably not a question I want to ask. Really, is it? Okay. We need to go see Clint. I haven't talked to my scarecrows. All right, just one, and just two. Okay. The cat needs watering. It also needs petting and the chickens need to be made a fuss of, but we haven't quite got there yet. Checking for forage on the way through because I don't always come back this way. Lucky purple shorts. Okay. I mean, they could just be bathing shorts. No. I have a bad feeling about this. I think if I remember rightly, we can actually find them in um, Marnie's house. Let us go and see Clint. Which, you know, is really neither here nor there. I don't know what he's embarrassed about. They're both grown-ups. And neither of them are married. Oh wait, let's just get out of that and go talk to Clint. You brought the ores I requested. Eat. I like to inspect local ores from time to time to keep track of quality and abundance. Let me just take a look at these. Hmm, I see. Thank you. You can keep these ores. They're a good quality. And here's your payment, as promised. Really? I get to keep them and I get paid. Ha, oh, even better. All right, the mayor's shorts, find and return Mayor Lewis's purple shorts. Discreetly. Okay, let's process our geodes. Well, we have space. You never know, we might get some more museum donations out of it. Ooh, have I had that one before? Neckerwhite. More copper. Awesome. Uh, more Neckerwhite. Not so awesome, but we can ship it. It'll be fine. Coal, which we need. More stone. Ooh, what's that? Or piment. Okay. Petrified slime. Man, that slime got scared good, right? Okay. Thank you, Clint. All right, so what we might do is we might um, process our next lot of copper bars. And I don't know. I'll see how we're going for... Um, things okay so I got one thing out of there that I hadn't got before one absolutely terrified slime all right so I think everything else probably needs to be um, shipped so what we might do is make our leisurely way home have a chat to Abigail have you decorated your house at all that's what I'd be doing if I had a house I'm sure you would sweetheart let's go I'll talk to you. It must be satisfying to follow your crop from seed to harvest. It's as if your essence is infused into the fruit. Uh, I don't know if I want my essence to be infused into any kind of fruit, really. I would like my essence to just stay infused into me. because people eat fruit I don't want people eating my essence that's just no there will be no infusing of fruits with my essence that's not gonna happen
I'm sure it sounds good in a writerly kind of way, but uh, in a farmerly kind of way, it's just a little bit freaky. This morning, I accidentally stepped on a bug. Are you okay? I, I won't ask after the bug. She looks upset enough as it is. Okay. I thought I saw what his face head this way. Maybe he didn't. Maybe he... Oh, maybe he went to visit Haley. Actually, that's interesting. Let's go see if he did. Because, like I said, I haven't followed their routines. Ha, huh, he did go visit Haley. Let's talk to Haley then. Uh, yes? I didn't hear you. I'm thinking about something else. <laughs> hey, farm girl, I got a question for you. Do you think I'll ever turn pro? Oh, maybe if you practice a lot. Yeah, well, I'm so good. I'm not going to have to practice all that much. Uh, I don't think I want to answer your question anymore. It doesn't rain much in summer, does it? That just means more watering for you, huh? Uh, yep. <laughs> Is that a friendly reminder? I don't know. We'll have to see. All right. So our theory on the mayor's shorts is that it's in at Marnie's house. Let me just duck down here and see if there's anything there. You know, if I didn't know better, I would say he's sweet on uh, on the art lady and is just kind of, you know, waiting for her to come out of her house, in which case he missed her. Maybe not. Howdy. I'm just here to make sure all of Marnie's business needs are met. Uh, okay. Purple shorts. Yeah. You're not good enough friends with Marnie to... Well, let me work on that. You can use a scythe to cut feed from grass. Or you can buy it from me, of course. I could use the cash. Adios. You know what, Marnie? You've actually raised a really good point. Because I need ten of these. For a bundle. So we'll grab that. Thanks, Marnie. Did you see all the hay bales in Jasmine's room? That was kind of cute. I'm not sure what they're doing in there. Maybe she's making like a fort or something with them. I know, I'm looking for... I should have got... No, I don't... Yeah, I should, I'm glad I didn't get more seeds. I wouldn't have been able to buy my hay for my bundle. We are looking for those orange fruits. And I have a feeling that the different... Um, forage bits can be found at, at different times during the season that they're found in. I never really noticed it before. Maybe maybe it's a new thing or maybe it's just something I, I was too busy exploring the game to kind of catch on to. But it, it really strikes me that um, you tend to see some things earlier in the season than others. I could be wrong. There we go. That that is that is what we need for our bundles. So we're definitely going to go out and grab the bundles in a minute, and um, and put what we can into the into the um, center. So we'll see what that brings us. I'm pretty sure we watered everything before we left. I know my head's a bit like a sieve, and we also need to wander. Is that my chicken? There you go, you get a pat chicken. We also need to wander a little bit over this way. I keep forgetting to check this little area here for forage as well. Sometimes, sometimes there's a little bit in there. Sometimes, looks like not today. But the other thing I keep forgetting to do is wandering up here. Just to see what might have washed up on the shore. And that reminds me, I should prepare some pasture for the cows because I don't want them too near the chickens. Not that they fight, just that, um, yeah. All right, first things first, we need our coal. Oh, and I need to ship a bunch of stuff again. So let's just also get the, um, all 
All right, so I'm just going to get rid of those and that. Man, I'm going to be donating a gold star berry. Almost makes me sad. And that. I mean, I also need to ship one of those, but we won't do that today. Just move that out. We will grab our... Pop that in there. I should take the bombs out mining as well. They're really not doing me any good in here. Just grab this, put it up here. All right. I don't think I've got 10 clay. No. All right, that's fine. It's getting late in the day too. All right, let's just leave those run. We'll just uh, offload what we've got here. And we will grab oops, the rest of our forage. So I need, I need the grape. One of those can go back. I know it's my only one spot, so we're going to give that. We need that because while we're there, we might as well put that away. Pretty sure that's all I've got that needs to go in the... Um, in the tanks. Yeah, we're at seven bat wings and 45 slime. So we need to go deeper into the mines basically because um, we've got to reach level 40. I think that's our latest mission. So we've got a little bit to do. I might just go and put these bundles away and see what we get for the filling the bundle that we've found. I'm not seeing a lot of worms in my travels. I always, I always remember them as being a little bit more frequent, but maybe maybe I'm just not in the right place at the right time. All right. And away we go. Bulletin board for the, um, the wizard's bundle. The enchanter's bundle, my bad. Pop that in there. I'm pretty sure there's there's nothing yet. So there's nothing else we've really got. Cool. Our red cabbages. We might see if we can grow some of those. Chef's bundle. Poppies. We'll go see if we can grow some of those then. I tend to ignore the flowers. It's a little bit naughty, but there you go. There we go. All right, so I now need wheat and apples. So I should save up for an apple tree as well. What we're doing, we're doing the forage bundle, weren't we? So down in here. All right, I know. Yes. All right. Wow. Okay, summer seeds. It's very tempting to sell them. I know. But it just seems a shame to sell the bundle. Wait. The last room? Yes. All right. Now, see, now we're going to be perpetually broke. Because. I know. Let's not scare the Junimo. Because that last bundle up here. Actually, speaking of last bundle, I think I can finish the summer, the fish one as well. So 10,000 G, 5,000 G, 25,000 G. Oh my lord. Let's have a quick look at our fish bundles because I think, yeah, the tuna, the red snapper, and the tilapia are all summer fish. So we can actually finish that one as well. Hmm. Ooh, and it's getting dark. 9 p.m.? I think it's time for a very short stint in the mines. Yes, a very short stint in the mines. 
And I should make some more of those, um, what do you call it? How much space is in my pack? I'm going to actually take a risk that I don't need to offload anything uh, at the moment. I've only got five, five snack bars as well. Ooh, I should probably put some torches down here. Alrighty, let's see if we can find our opening. See, you don't normally luck out like I do with the copper. It's, there we are. One. Like I did with that last run. Really pleased to have seen that. Oh, just trying to remember where I saw it. I don't think I usually see it. It might actually be up here. Now I've really got the urge to go in. Swat that bug. See if it opens up a tunnel underneath it. Well, fine. Ooh. <laughs> yep, I did not wish to stay and deal with all the beetles and the things that come flying out. All right. Is this the one I think it is? Ooh. Being chased by little thunderbugs. I know you watch. I'll, I'll go all the way around. 12 a.m. Yep, okay, fine. You convinced me it's time to leave. <laughs> oh man, I think chicken noises are appropriate for this. Alrighty, so what we're going to do is we're going to take our little character home. Ooh, an Omni Geode. Oh, awesome. See if we can offload our stuff without getting eaten uh, by a slime. And uh, then I might call it an end to the episode. I don't didn't get down to level 25. We might have to move ourselves a little bit on that. Alrighty, we have some of that. And we have some of that, some of that, some of that. That can be shipped. That can go in there. That can go in there. That can go in there. I know, will I get mugged? I know that thing. Actually, let's sell. Yeah, let's sell all of those. I know. I've never, ever sold that bundle before, so I'm having second thoughts already. And we'll just see how we go with it. But on that note, I'll leave you. If you enjoyed the episode, please hit like. And if you want to see more, please hit subscribe. Wow, how much are they worth each? 55G apiece. Cool. And that's it. Thanks, guys. I'll see you around.